Closing schools is creating a controversy in one local community. Thanks for staying with us here at 530. I'm Renee Murphy. And I'm Doug Prophet. A plan to combine two closing schools into a new downtown location in Jeffersonville has caught the attention of a Clark County, Indiana judge who says the area in question is unsafe. WHAS 11's Holden Kerwicki looked into those concerns today. Every day, hundreds of people come down Court Avenue to come to the Clark County Courthouse. That includes people on parole, probation, and even violent felons. And that's why Judge Vicki Carmichael tells the News and Tribune she's concerned by a plan to put a new school right across the street. There has been a school standing on this property for about 100 years now. Behind me, there is an active school in operation that Greater Clark operates. I don't understand somebody saying this is not a good place for a school. Since Greater Clark announced that they were planning to close two downtown elementary schools due to declining enrollment, Mayor Mike Moore has been pushing for a new building at the site of the old Jeff High. The future and the development of the city of Jeff, all of the growth that we've seen in the last five years is going to continue as long as we provide a great elementary school. I'm all about that to take that away from downtown would be devastating. Superintendent Andrew Mellon confirmed that the district is interested in the site since they already own the property and operate the nearby Corden Porter School. We have had kids uh, down there for decades. Um, long long before the, the new Corden Porter building, we had students down there going to school. You have the Nahan Field House that's right there that has a lot of young people. This is a safe haven. We're one block away from the public library. Uh, my gosh, everything you want for a kid is right here. With the Sheriff's Department located right next door, I mean, it could be one of the safest uh, places uh, in Clark County. Greater Clark County Schools are doing feasibility studies on a number of sites. They hope to have a single site narrowed down by the end of the year. In Jeffersonville, Indiana, Holden Kerwicki, WHAS 11 News.